The development, assessment, and implementation of health and safety programs and policies are carried out by the Safety and Risk Management Office. Additionally, they extend support and resources to faculty members while actively contributing to maintaining a safe and healthy environment for faculty, staff, students, and visitors within their residences. I've shared a more detailed breakdown of their responsibilities below. The SRMO is tasked with devising all-encompassing health and safety programs and policies that cover a broad spectrum of potential risks and hazards in the organization. The objective is to prevent mishaps, injuries, or other unfavorable occurrences. Adapting programs and policies. To keep up with ever-changing health and safety regulations and best practices, the SRMO adjusts its programs and policies accordingly. Regular adaptations identify areas for improvement, ensuring compliance with relevant laws while staying abreast of the latest standards and recommendations. Enforcement. Upon developing or revising health and safety programs and policies, the SRMO must enforce their implementation across the organization. This encompasses effectively communicating the guidelines to all pertinent individuals, delivering essential training sessions, and guaranteeing adherence to these policies. The SRMO extends its support and resources to various individuals, including faculty members, staff personnel, and students. This encompasses offering guidance on maintaining safe work practices, organizing training sessions, distributing necessary safety equipment, as well as promptly addressing any queries or concerns related to health and safety. Risk Evaluation and Prevention The SRMO conducts thorough evaluations to identify potential dangers and risks within the organization. This includes analyzing various aspects like the physical surroundings, procedures, and operations. After identifying these risks, the SRMO takes proactive measures to prevent accidents or harm and guarantee the well-being of all individuals involved. The SRMO holds significant responsibility in the formulation and execution of emergency response strategies. This encompasses devising protocols for emergencies like fires, natural catastrophes, medical crises, etc. Regular training sessions and practice drills are frequently organized to ensure individuals can react efficiently in such circumstances. Compliance and reporting. The SRMO is responsible for ensuring the organization's compliance with pertinent health and safety regulations and standards. It also ensures that all necessary reporting and documentation are completed accurately, without delays. Continuous enhancement. Ensuring safety remains a top priority and the SRMO consistently seeks improvement. The organization identifies opportunities for refinement by carefully analyzing incidents, near misses, and stakeholder feedback. This invaluable information aids in the enhancement of existing policies and programs to proactively prevent similar incidents in the future. The Safety and Risk Management Office is pivotal in establishing and preserving a safety-conscious atmosphere within the organization. Its endeavors not only benefit the overall welfare of everyone but also set a secure setting that encourages learning, productivity, and overall prosperity. Matthew, thank you for spreading awareness, and I hope this video reaches a broad audience.